Hello students. In the previous lecture, we have seen the numericals on how to find the question and the remainder. And in this lecture, we are going to see the type which is check whether the first polynomial is a factor of the second polynomial by dividing the second polynomial by the first polynomial is x square minus 3x plus 1 comma x raised to 5 minus 4x cube plus x square plus 3x plus 1. Means you will divide first and then you will get a remainder. Its remainder is 0, then it is a factor of p of x. Its remainder is not 0, then it is not a factor of p of x. Correct? Then solve this example. First we will write the divide. Then x cube minus 3x plus 1. You will write here x cube minus 3x plus 1 and here x raised to 5 minus 4x cube plus x square plus 3x plus 1. Then this x raised to 5 is divided by this x cube in the rough page. You will write here x raised to 5 divided by this x cube. Then you will get x raised to 5 minus 3. Then you will get x raised to 2. Then x raised to 2 you will write here. Then this x square will be multiplied by this g of x that is x. x cube minus 3x plus 1. This x square multiplied by this x cube. Then you will get x raised to Correct. Again, this x square multiplied by this 3x. But here minus sign is taken. Then plus sign minus is minus. Then minus 3x cube. Here minus 3x cube. Minus 3 will be same. This x square multiplied by x is x cube. And again, you will multiply by this plus 1. That is x square into 1 is x square. Correct? Then you will write here x raised to 5 minus 3x cube plus x square. Here x raised to 5, x raised to 5 is present x cube, x cube, x square, x square. Then this plus sign is converting to minus, this minus sign is converting to plus, and this plus sign is converting to minus. Then Plus x raised to 5 minus x raised to 5 they are cancelled because opposite sign is taken here. Then we will subtract then we will get 0. Then minus 4 plus 3. Here minus 4 plus 3 is minus 1 x cube. But you, will, you don't write here 1 only you will write here minus x cube means minus 4 plus 3. Then you will write here minus x cube. Here. Plus x square minus x square will be cancelled. Here plus x square minus x square will be cancelled. And the other terms are plus 3x plus 1. Plus 3x plus 1. Then again this minus x cube is divided by this x cube. Minus x cube divided by this x cube, x cube, x cube cancel. Then you will get minus 1. Then you will write here minus 1. And this minus 1 will be multiplied by x square minus 3x plus 1. Then you will get minus 1 into x square is minus x square. This minus minus will be plus that 3x. This 1 into 3x, 3x. And this minus plus minus. And 1 into 1 is 1. See here. Then you will write here. Minus x cube plus 3x minus 1. Right here. Minus x cube plus 3x minus 1. This sign will be changed. That is this minus is converted into plus. This plus is converted into minus. This minus is converted to plus. Then 
minus x cube plus x cube is cancelled. Again here plus 3 minus 3 is cancelled. Here plus 1 plus 1 is 2. Here remainder is 0? No. Here remainder is not 0. Here remainder is what? 2. Then it is not a factor of P of X. Here remainder is what? 2. Then it is not a factor of P of X. That is X is to 5 minus 4x cube plus x square plus 3x plus 1. So, let's get started with type number 6. Then your type 6 is obtain all the zeros. Obtain all the zeros. 3x is to 4 plus 6x cube minus 2x square minus 10x minus 5 if 2 of its zeros are root 5 by 3 and minus root 5 by 3 means they are the zeros means alpha equal to we have alpha equal to root 5 by 3 and beta equal to minus root 5 by 3 correct then we will write here x minus alpha and x minus beta. We will write here x minus alpha and x minus beta. Then we will get x minus under root of 5 by 3. x minus in bracket minus root 5 by 3 because b value is minus root 5 by 3. Then here minus minus will be plus. Then we will write here x minus root 5 by 3. Then minus minus will be plus root 5 by 3. Then which formula we can use? A minus B, A plus B equal to A square minus B square. Then A minus B into A plus B equal to A square minus B square. What is the value of A? A is X. What is the value of B? B is root 5 by 3. Then we will write here X square minus root 5 by 3 whole bracket square and x square minus 5 by 3 because in square under root is neglected then you will get x square minus 5 by 3 then divide here you will write 3x raised to 4 plus 6x cube minus 2x square minus 10x minus 5 and here you will write x square minus 5 by 3 then your rough page this minus 3x raised to 4 Divided by this x square, then you will get 3x raised to 4 minus 2 equal to 3x square. This 3x raised to 4 divided by this x square equal to this x raised to 2 will be transfer upper side. Then 3x raised to 4 minus 2, then 3x square. Then you will write here 3x square. And this 3x square will be multiplied by this. And this 3x square will be multiplied by this. That is, you will get 3 into 1, 3. x square into x square, x raised to 4. Then minus into plus, minus. And 3x square multiplied by 5 by 3. Then here, 3, 3 will be cancelled. You will get 3x raised to 4 minus 5x square. And you will write here 3x raised to 4. Minus 5x square. Then here sign is plus. Then this will be changed. That is minus. Then sign is minus. Then this will be changed. Then sign is plus. Then plus 3x raised to 4. Minus 3x raised to 4 is cancelled. Then 6x cube. Here minus 2 plus 5 is plus 3x square. Minus 10x. 
minus i. They are same. The next operation is divided by x square. Then 6, 6, x raised to 3 minus 2 equal to 6x because 3 minus 2 is 1. Then you will write here plus 6x. And this plus 6x is multiplied by x square minus 5 by 3. Then you will get 6x into x square. This 6 into 1, 6. x into x square that is x cubed minus this 6x multiplied by 5 by 3. Then 3 ones are 3 and 3 twos are 6. That is 6x cube minus 5 twos are 10 x. Then you will write here 6x cube minus 10x. Then this plus is converted into minus. This minus is converted into plus. They are cancelled. They are cancelled because the numbers are same, it's um, x cube, x cube, x cube is same, only the signs are different. Then, remainder is 3x square minus 5. Again, the next operation. This, 3x square divided by this x square, this 3x square divided by this x square. Then x square, x square will be cancelled, you will get 3. And this 3 is multiplied by this, that is 3 is multiplied by x square minus 5 by 3. Then you will get 3x square minus 3 into 5 by 3. 3, 3 will be cancelled, then 3x square minus 5. Then 3x square minus 5, then you will write here 3x square minus 5. Then this plus is converted to minus, this minus is converted to plus. They are cancelled, you will get 0. You will get 0. Then, you are here, sorry, here plus 3. Plus 3 is taken here. Because you will multiply by 3x square plus 3. Then, your q of x is what? 3x square plus 6x plus 3. Here q of x is, x is what? 3x square plus 6x plus 3. Then factorize. 3, 3 is 9. And the middle term is 6. Middle term is 6. Then you will write here 3, 3 is 9. And also 3 plus 3 is 6. Then you will write here 3x square plus 3x plus 3x plus 3. Then write here, here 3 is common in bracket 3. x is common in bracket x plus 1. Plus 3 is common in bracket x plus 1 because 3 ones are 3. Then these two brackets are same. Then you will write x plus 1 and in second bracket you will write 3x plus for q of x equal to 0 then x plus 1 equal to 0 and 3x plus 3 equal to 0. Then x equal to 0 minus 1 then you will get x equal to minus 1. Your plus sign is present then you will transfer in that side then you will get minus 1 then x equal to minus 1. Here also 3x equal to 0 minus 3. Then you will get 3x equal to minus 3. Then x equal to minus 3 by 3. 3 ones are 3. Then your second 0 is minus 1. Means your remainder, means your other zeros are, your other zeros are minus 1 and minus 1. Your other zeros are minus 1 and minus 1. One. Okay. And the rest we will see in the next lecture. Okay.